In this video, we present Kokiri, a visual analytics approach that allows users to compare cohorts by the high dimensional data, explore the driving differences, and characterize the homogeneity and outliers of the cohorts. We integrated Kokiri into Coral, a cohort analysis tool for creating and characterizing cohorts. To demonstrate Kokiri, we continue an analysis from an existing session in Coral in which the user analyzes the differences between cohorts of non-small cell lung cancer of different race and gender. A recent study has shown differences in the KRAS mutation frequency between these cohorts. With Kokiri, we want to investigate whether there are any further mutational differences. We start by selecting the six cohorts and select the characterized operation which integrates Kokiri in Coral. As the cohorts are created by splitting the data into distinct subsets, the overlap view only shows a short note that the cohorts do not overlap. In the next step, we can compare the cohorts by the metadata or genetic mutation frequency. By default, the comparison only considers attributes that were not used to create the cohorts. We compare the cohorts by mutation frequency, which starts training a random forest model to classify the cohorts based on the high dimensional data. A random forest consists of an ensemble of decision trees. We gradually increase the number of decision trees and show intermediate results to give users early feedback on cohort separability and important attributes. For the six lung cancer cohorts, we can see that most items are correctly assigned to the white female and male cohorts, which are the two largest cohorts. However, also large portions of patients from the other cohorts are assigned to these two cohorts. In the attribute importance table on the left, the first results show that the genes TP53, EGFR, STK11, FGFR4, and KRAS are the most different between these six cohorts. The mutation frequency of TP53 is high in all cohorts, as expected, being the most frequently mutated gene in this dataset. We can see that male cohorts have more mutations than the female cohorts of the same race. The opposite is observed in the distribution of EGFR mutations, where the mutation is more prevalent in the female patients than in the male patients of the same race. We can also see a clear difference between the two Asian patient cohorts and the others. Noticeable is also the distribution of FGFR4 mutations, where the bars are hardly visible. We can further investigate the distribution of FGFR4 mutations in chorus view operation. Here we see that there is indeed little difference in the number of mutations, but it is sequenced much less frequently for the two black cohorts. This points to possible issues in the data. Next, we further analyze the trained classifier with the characterization view in Kokiri. The table on the left lists all patients, the cohorts they belong to, and by which probability they belong to that cohort according to the classifier. We also have the highest probability as a separate column to quickly judge whether the model was sure or unsure about this item. On the right side, these probabilities are summarized in an embedding scatterplot. The scatterplot shows a distinct cluster for each of the six cohorts, but also many smaller clusters as well as single items. By hovering over one of the smaller clusters, we see that the probability for the assignment to the Asian female cohort was just 26%. We select the items in this cluster, which also selects them in the item ranking, where we can see probabilities for all other cohorts. Even though the items in this cluster originate from different cohorts, the prediction probabilities are very similar, suggesting that the data is similar as well. This could be a point in the analysis where the user leaves Kokiri and defines new cohorts based on the findings or investigates individual items in more detail. 
In this quick overview of Kokiri, we showed how to compare patient cohorts by the high dimensional data, explore the driving differences between the cohorts, and characterize the homogeneity and outliers of the cohorts. Thanks for watching and feel free to try Kokiri yourself.